Hey guys, so we got this gigantic blue and white painting going. Let's get it rocking. So, today I'm doing a special painting for, it's actually a commission. I'm attempting to somewhat replicate one of my other paintings. I don't like doing the same painting twice, but also I think that this painting is special enough and I know that I can do it just as cool. So um, I'm pretty excited for this. A uh, little stressed, but the nice part is if I do mess it up, then I can just do it again, right? There's no, I don't know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> I think that there's no mess ups here. There, you can always retry and that's fine, right? So what the plan is, is I'm gonna do this circle till about right here and then I'm gonna pull it and then I'm gonna do a, a, a long and skinny pendulum from here and then one more kind of like 45 degree angle painting from this angle. So that's the plan anyways. We'll see how well it goes. Um, but yeah, stay tuned here. I think it's gonna be really nice. I'm gonna go ahead and pull this probably in about four swings, maybe five. So one, two, three, or one more. All right, got five swings done. Now let's go this way. Here we go. Beautiful. Oh, that's perfect. Nice. Plan for this is this to spin and end up right about here, really tight, kind of rectangle shape, if that makes sense. I'm gonna fill it up with more paint after this swing. The only tricky part is there's so much, uh, what do you call it? There's so much texture on this. I'm worried that it's not gonna turn out the same. Um, it might be a little bumpy, but we'll see. Like I said, if it messes up, we can always redo it, right? So no harm, no foul here for the most part. I am quite stressed though. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to go ahead and pull this in three swings, one, two, three, all right, quickly put some more paint, okay, there we go, and then, boom. If all goes well, this will be the completed painting. This looks really good though. I'm excited. Um, yeah, it, my girlfriend was saying this painting can smell your fear, <laughs> pretty much. I, I don't think I've ever been so stressed for a painting. I, I think it's turning out really good though, because normally I just kind of like, for lack of a better term, YOLO it. But this time I really went through my thought process of like, okay, here's the swing I'm gonna do. I mapped it out of my head, which I'm not a good planner normally. Um, depends on the thing. But so most of the time I'm not a good planner. But today I said, screw it, why not plan something? So <laughs> that's what we're doing here today. Okay, so what's gonna happen here is this is gonna go in really tight and be about right here when it's finished. I want that oval to be really in tight. I love blue. Blue is just such a pretty color. This looks nice. What's gonna stink is if, if this dry doesn't dry well, I'm gonna be so sad. Like this looks amazing. Holy cow. Yeah, I wish you guys could see it from like, I think the far away view honestly is better for these paintings than the close up. Close ups are amazing, right? But I think the far away is just unmatched, but also the close-up shows you the texture. Like you probably can't see how much texture is on this canvas. It's it's pretty impressive. Like I've been working on this one for a while, um, and I'm glad it's going to a good home. This is a wood panel-backed painting or canvas. So uh, if you guys know anything about those, it's they're pretty pretty spicy. <laughs> All right, probably another like ten swings. I don't want it to get too layered in here. That's what I'm worried about. Like right in here, I don't want that to be too thick. So we're gonna go ahead and pull it pretty soon here. Boom. Two. 
two, one. There we go. Completed painting. Hopefully it dries well. Thanks for watching, guys. See you later.